So if you're looking for ways that you can work from home, doing data entry, right? Smart move. Besides, what is the best way that you can work from home if not online? And making some money doing this. <laughs> Hi there, welcome to Freedom Lifestyle channel. Bruno Cimero here. This is the channel where I help you create your true freedom lifestyle. So you're here, I assume that you're doing some research online on how to find some online jobs doing that and you know that you can do from home so that's basically what we talk what we will talk about in this video so if this is the first time that you're watching my video or you're in my channel consider subscribe and active that bell notification so you get notified every time i come up with new content that might be you know of your interest that you know somehow related to the niches that you are interested in Besides talking about data entry online, I have some additional bones that I wanted to share with you by the end of this video. So make sure you stick until the end. So you're here. I assume that you're doing some research online on how to make money, you know, how to find jobs online that you can work from home. In this case, doing data entry. And, you know, you may be someone that, you know, want to make you know some extra extra cash you know you want to do that type of work because it is in your you know skill set and all that so you're trying to find you know the best way that you can do it so before i talk about some of the online jobs on data entry i wanted to give a quick review on data entry so what is exactly data entry so data entry is an industry where employees add verify and you know edit electronic data you know Basically, it implies the put of data from, you know, to a computer or a system. And in this case, when you're doing online, you're using computer, you know, to store, store them in some database or something like that. Basically, what you're doing, you're doing data management and organization. And you're, you know, simply uh, converting a file from a source to another. That can be to a, for example, a audio to PDF, you know, you can transcribe it or it can be, you know, something on a PDF that you can, you know, uh, create a table on a Excel and, you know, introduce those important data that you are required to or something like that. Easy peasy, right? The question that you might be asking is like being a simple task, why? wouldn't people do it themselves, you know, why not? Because it is crucial for, you know, companies' operation, performance, and, and productivity. And instead of the, you know, leaders of companies and people on their company focus on those small tasks that they can outsource, you know, they can focus on the big picture, you know, to make the company make more revenue, you know, to grow and all that. So instead of, you know, contracting people, you know, to go on their offs and do those kind of work, you know, they go on the internet, you know, and they hire people to do that. Also, you know, there is a lot of advantage of doing data entry online because of its superior security. You know, basically when you're doing data entry now to get access to your document, you basically need to put some sort of, to create some sort of username and password on a platform or system, you know, a data entry uh, company or something like that. So you can get access to, to those documents. So uh, basically it's safer than, you know, putting them on a lock. And also data entry online provides storage convenience. Basically when you're doing, you know, you're storing your those document on a, um, database you know, on the cloud you know online and you can access it from anywhere in the world anytime using the internet and you know your computer or laptop or something like that so that's why another reason that companies are you know betting strongly on outsourcing uh, when it comes to data entry besides as i said you know you can access it from anywhere at any time so there's another Another advantage, you know, the ease access to those data for the company. Also, it provides low cost. You know, you don't need to, you know, the company you don't need to hire people, you know, to stay on their offices so they can, you know, put those 
input those data on a computer something like that instead you know they hire people online people like you in this case you know to to do those sort of tasks for them like typing transcribing coding and you know word processing you know those uh, data entry online includes some occupations such as for example typist you know there's some sort of uh, people you know might tell you what they need to do you know what they how they want some sort of uh, things to be you know for example uh, a document a PDF they may give you a lot of document that they want you to type it you know to create some sort of organize it and manage it, manage that those kind of con content and you know document and all that also you can do transcribing basically you know companies or individuals or you know uh, you know public services such as hospitals government and all that they may they have you know they deal with a lot of paperwork and all that and document so they need to somehow manage those document information that they may need you know later on for example they may hire you to uh, to transcribe some some of the bullet points on certain meets or you know meeting record a video or a audio or something like that or to extract some in, in important data of information on such a meet, meeting and you know transcribe them to a uh, excel table or something like that also it includes word processing they may have a lot of sheets and paper that they need to you know analyze document in pdf or word they need to analyze you know if it, every word is correct and everything is in place so instead of doing that during themselves you know they hire people to do that for them you know to do those kind of service so by now you must be wondering how much you know how much you can make you know by doing data entry you know how much you can be paid when it comes to data entry there is no uh, uh you know fixed fee or something like that because you can be uh hired or paid by project you know you can be paid by keystrokes per minute you know how much how many key keystrokes you know you do you hit during a minute there's six seconds or uh, keystrokes per word or keystrokes per hour or for example you can receive a hourly wage so when you're doing data entry basically you need some sort of skills such as attention to details for example if you are doing you know trans you are transcribing some sort of a document from a source to another you know you need to pay attention to those details because uh, you don't want to miss any word you don't want to miss any details that might be important for the company and if so they might not trust your service or work anymore so uh, you need to have some concentration and attention to detail so also you need uh, so to have some sort of organizational skills because when you're doing those data management and organization you will separate them you know by the order for example order of importance you need to know how to input those data that you know the company or people in there will have a better understanding and also somehow you need to be tireless when it comes to doing repetitive tasks because if you are for example you're applied to do transcribing that's basically what you will do so during the day you may be asked to do a lot of work such as transcribing so uh, you gotta be somehow tireless in this case now without any further ado i'm gonna show you some data entry company or platform that you can apply and you know start doing some data entry and all that so keep watching so the first one that we're going to talk about is action action is a uh, data entry you know platform where you can go there and you register and you start doing some data entry works uh, here is the action platform where you can find some crucial information on the company on the service that they provide on no on the you know the fees and about employment how you can you know register to their database and you know and all that so I prepared some you know topics to talk about about you know action data what they really are you know and as you can see action data is a you know is a data entry company that has been in business since 1996 so 
they have been in business for a while and they are well known by you know the pug overall so you can say that they are a trusted data entry company uh there is some information on how you can apply to action data as you can see here uh, before they didn't require you know any sort of experience and all that but now they are you know asking for some you know people that can apply to their to to the action data platform it's only people that as two or three years of you know experience and for some of you this is some bad news but you know i've got something else that i wanted to share with you so stick around and actually also to apply to action data you need at least you know 15 keystrokes 15,000 keystrokes per hour or basically you can say it is <laughs> it is 50 word per minute you know and here is you know you know how much do action contractors make you know when it comes to short forms you can make four to eight cents and it can range around from nine to fifty dollar you know and that's per hour also you can uh you can make a contract you know by making you know by document you know which you can you can be paid five to nine dollar depending on the document and those are larger document and data you know to you know to process so you don't actually need a specialized job you know you don't uh, it is not about a specialized job it is you know simple job that you can do but in this case they are requiring some sort of you know experience and also it doesn't require high skill level so you know i guess you're good to go so coming here to their website you know you can see how you can you can see their requirement you, can, you know you can see their career and how you can register on their database actually at the moment you know there are there is no opening because they rarely open but when it's open you can uh, register it register there and all that so also you can find everything about the uh, the company here all the information that you need to know and all those you know a few case that you can see you know the second one that i wanted to talk about is dian data so here is the dian data platform as you can see and also where you can find all the information about the company their profile you know uh what they do for how long they have existed and uh also if they are trusted or not and all that and also you can find about you know their uh, service that they provide such as you know uh, you know service inventory listing that and service and all that also you can also find about their mission what is you know what they do you know what is the milestone their goals and things that they want to reach and service that they want to provide and all that as you can see here and you know you can even contact them you know if you need some information or and things like that uh also i prepared some sheet that i wanted to share with you about you know diary data and here are some information such as how much does diary data pay basically here we can see that diary data they pay for example for piece of work you know they give you a piece of work and when you do that work you know uh, or for example instead of using keystroke per word per hour or minute you know they pay you according to the piece of project they give you so that's how you pay you so also uh, about the requirement for work for dying data we have some here you you need to you know type at least 60 word per minute meanings that you you need to be fast you know you need to write at least a word per second or something like that so you can meet their you know this requirement and also they they demand that you understand have a little bit of good understand on how to use computer uh, based things you know like you know navigating on internet emailing i know things like attachment and you know download files and all that 
So those are some of the requirement that they, they require from you. So basically, this is how the application process work, you know, and uh, uh, you can download it on their website and fill it out, you know, and they are asking you from you some uh, basic information such as your past work history to know uh, if you have some experience in this field or something related or if you really can handle the work that uh, and service that they provide and all that, you know, because they want to provide good service. So, you know that. So also they would like to know your uh, typing speed, you know, so if you type fast or something like that, that can be a big advantage for you. And also they ask for country of residence. In this case, unfortunately, as action that, you know, diving data also, you know, it requires you to be from United States. Uh, so you can, you can be legally uh, and eligible in United States to work, you know, so that's one of the limitation of, you know, action data. But, you know, don't get discouraged, be discouraged because I've got some good news to share with you. So stay tuned, keep watching. Last but not least, we have Click Worker. And here, as you can see, the Click Worker website, you know, and you can see how, you know, their policy, how they work and all that. And, you know, the service that they provide and how you can, you know, uh, some of the opportunities for with applicants and all that. So basically those are the services that they provide such as AI training data, you know, text creation and all that. So uh, basically the, there, this is some information about, you know, the company or individual that wants to uh, do some data entry. So uh, basically those are the information that you need to know from uh, Click Worker. Also, here are some of, you know, things that you, you will do as AI training, all specified, you know, you can go through the website, you know, you can read, you can see what resonates with you the most. And you can do your research on your own, for example, some review on those, you know, data entry companies to to see if you, what other people are saying about them and if it's really trustable and all that also i prepared some uh uh you know bullet points that i want to share with you in this case about the for example click worker community and as you can see click worker is about 2.2 million click works you know and you know they really believe strongly in their solution that they provide and also you know they are very simple to use and all that so here are some of the requirements that they require for people to to apply to their you know service you know to be an employee so here as you can see there is no uh, special qualification necessary and it's easy to to be part of their community and you can get paid regardless of your academic qualification so there's a big advantage so also about their you know click worker you know the tasks that you can do on click workers those tasks include data research and verif verification for example you know a company may uh, ask to do some research on a certain marketing you know some data they may need to you know for the company or individual to process some sort of uh, uh, crucial information and all that. Also, they provide translation of text in different languages. So if you understand something like that, you know, there is a good news for you. Also, beside, you know, you can do the data collection, you know, local data collection through your smartphone and all that. So those are, you know, the data entry jobs opportunity that I wanted to talk with you. I hope that you find some of them, you know, useful and somehow that can be helpful to you and all that. And also don't forget to you to do your own research, you know, you know, on them to see what is people saying about them. If you know it it worth give it a try or not, if it worth your time, your effort 
and you know some of them they charge some fee uh, to be part of that company such as action in this case uh, so uh, be sure to do your own work and all that so now as i said you know doing data entry requires of you some sort of skills and you know attention to details organizational skills and all that so if you don't have that you may have a sort of you know problem uh, doing the task that they ask you to do so basically you can also find trainings online on how you can do those sort of tasks faster you know efficiently and all that and the bonus that i want to talk about is actually is another online business opportunity that is affiliate marketing is one of my favorite personal business model because uh, basically when you're doing affiliate marketing you don't need any particular skills or experience on any area you know you can turn your passion you know uh, or your skills or experience or whatever you love to do into a monetizable business into a profitable business you can work from you know online you know using your internet and, and Wi-Fi connection and your smartphone and also you can promote others you can make money while promoting other people's products basically affiliate marketing works like this you know uh, you promote somebody else's products and you get a commission in return another advantage is that you know your audience is global you can you know you can make money like selling online products digitally and those products aren't even yours you don't even have to have the work to do with the customer support the employees pay payment and all that you no know? and it is very flexible and you can work in any niche imaginary you can do spirituality you can do dog training you can do weight loss finance business books and all that you know the options are endless so if you like it or something like that you would like to learn more about it I've got a four-day training that will teach you all the basics about affiliate marketing you know how it works you know all the process uh, of the the creation and setup and all that so if you're interested just click the first link right below this video and you're gonna get access to those four free training so what do you think you think that you can start a data entry job or affiliate marketing or uh, what is the best for you so let me know by leaving a quick comment below well i really hope that you enjoyed this video see you soon take care